Dear students, now we are going to solve one important problem in zero dissipation line. Before going to solve the problem, let's discuss important formulas to be used in this problem. Characteristics impedance for zero dissipation line is Z0 is equal to R0 that is equal to square root of L by C. L is the inductance, C is the capacitance of the line. Attenuation constant for zero dissipation line is zero. There is no attenuation, okay? Propagation constant beta is equal to omega into square root of LC. Velocity of propagation is B is equal to 1 by square root of LC. Wavelength lambda is equal to 2 by by beta, okay? Here the problem. A line with zero dissipation has R is equal to 0 0.006 ohm per meter. C is equal to 4.45 picofarad per meter. L is equal to 2.5 micro Henry per meter. If the line is operated at 10 megahertz, find the characteristics impedance, attenuation constant, propagation constant, lambda and velocity of propagation. So here first we have to write the given data from the problem. So here resistance is equal to 0 0.006 ohm per meter. Inductance L is equal to 2.5 micro Henry per meter. Capacitance is equal to 4.45 picofarad per meter. Frequency F is equal to 10 megahertz. Okay. In the solution part, first we are going to find out the characteristics impedance for the dissipation less line. Dissipation less means zero dissipation. So here the formula is R0 is equal to square root of L by C. Here we can substitute the values of L and C. L value is 2.5 into 10 to the power minus 6. Micro means what? 10 to the power minus 6. Next capacitance value is 4.45 into 10 to the power minus 12. Picofarad means what? Minus 12. Then we can get the answer as 749.5 ohm. This is the characteristics impedance for the given data. Next for zero dissipation line, the attenuation constant becomes zero. Here alpha is equal to what? Zero. Next one is propagation constant beta. Beta is equal to omega into square root of LC. Omega can be written as 2 pi F. Okay, so here F value is what? 10 megahertz. 10 into 10 to the power plus 6. Okay, then substitute the values of F, L and C here. We can get the answer as beta is equal to 0 0.2095 radians per meter. Next one is velocity of propagation. B is equal to 1 by square root of LC. So here we can substitute the value of L as 2.5 into 10 to the power of minus 6. C as 4.45 into 10 to the power of minus 12. Then we can get the answer as velocity of propagation for the given dissipation less line. V is equal to 2.998 into 10 to the power plus 8 meter per second. Okay. Then the last one is wavelength of the line. Lambda is equal to 2 pi by beta. What is the value of beta? 0 0.2095. We can substitute that value here. Then the lambda value is equal to 29.99 meter. Okay.